welcome to the recording for PS number seven. Um, this one should be pretty easy. You might be uh, quite familiar with this, but if not, um, it should still be pretty easy. So we'll get started. Um, uh, so okay, according to the pie chart, what is the mo what is most of the monthly budget spent on? That should be pretty easy. Rent. I don't think any of you are getting um, that one wrong. All right, if the budget is four thousand. How much will be will you be able to save? Well, hold on now. Four thousand four thousand dollars in percentages. Like, what do we do? Go back to your number set skills. Um, so we got four thousand, and we're going to multiply it by how much we're able to save. Right? That's our savings. So uh, take your percentage and make it a decimal by going twice to the left. And then multiplying. So five times zero zero zero. Five times four is twenty. And then zeros all around. All right, we got a decimal there, so a decimal there. So we're gonna save two hundred dollars. That's what five percent of four thousand is two hundred dollars that's how you do it take that decimal or take that percent turn it to a decimal multiply it by uh... the budget and you get your total all right so the budget is three thousand how much will be spent on rent we're gonna do the same thing so three thousand and we're gonna uh... the rent is forty percent so twice to the left you can do it right on here is 0 0.40 so um, and then we'll just get rid of that um, zero there I mean you don't have to you can just put it there it won't matter but just to make things go faster so zero 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 four times three is twelve and then we get one decimal so one decimal uh, so we've got 1,200 is spent on rent. Okay, so if the budget is 4,000, how much more money is spent on transportation than utilities? Well, we got two of them now. So you're going to have to solve it twice. Uh, or no, not solve it twice, but you have two different um, problems just like we did up above. Because you've got to find out how much uh, you're spending on transportation, how much you're spending on utilities, two separate things, and then find the difference. Because how much more money is spent. So find the difference between the transportation budget and the utilities budget. So I'm going to scroll down and give it some more space. We're definitely going to need it for this one. Um, so transportation. 4,000 and it's uh, transportation is 25% so just going fast that's going to be 0.25 because you know, twice to the left so 0, 0, 0, 5 times 4 is 20 next row pop a 0 then 2 times 0, 2 times 0, 2 times 0, 4 times 2 is 8. So we got 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 2 decimals. So 1, 2, right there. So that's our transportation budget. And then now we've got to do utilities. So again, four thousand because we're still st working with the same budget. It's just a different portion of the budget. So utilities is ten percent. So that's going to be oh sorry, twice to the left to turn it into a decimal and multiply. So uh, zero 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 zero, uh, and then pop a zero down, and then four thousand. Pardon my writing. And so add, 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 and 
two numbers after a decimal, none up there. So decimal is going to go right here twice because there's two things to move. So that means $400 is our utility bill. So finally, what we're going to do is we're going to find the difference, right? How much more money is spent on transportation than utilities? So we're spending $1,000 on transportation and we're spending $400 on utilities, we subtract them and you should get 600. So we're spending 600 more on transportation than utilities. And it's just that, it's different variations of reading a graph, turning this information into other types of information. It's more about testing your ability to pay attention to detail than it is anything else. Because the math skills are stuff you guys have already practiced and have been practicing. Percents into decimals, decimals into percents even, um, multiplying decimals. Like this is, it should be all review for you. If you have any questions, let me know in class.